Hey guys, El Fideo Rubio here. So today I'm going to show you something that is going to save your life. So I'll show you the problem that I was having. I'm trying to disable the movement of the guy completely uh, before teleporting him because he has to sit down. So as I walk into the volume, you see the character can still walk, right? And now we transition into this scene that the character should, is supposed to like sit still. And if we eject, we can see that the character is here because uh, the movement input is still there. So this is something not as straightforward as you may think. So initially what I did, it's like find the best solution in order to stop him completely. So I found that if you disable the movement and then re-enable it by setting the movement to walking, that's the best, right? Uh, this was with an input and it worked right away. So I can press, I'm running now. I'm pressing F now, and you can see I'm pressing W ASD. I'm not moving at all. If I press F again, I can move, stop. Okay, cool. So then I was like, okay, why why is it not happening with the volume? You know. So I did all this complicated logic of adding a gate because I thought like maybe it was getting executed more than once and something was going wire there. It wasn't the case. I, I don't think so anyway. We'll we'll remove this. By the end of the video and we'll see so what did i do okay so this message that i have here right it's just disabling the movement setting the visibility all of these is just for my um just for my specific case scenario but you may you may be facing something similar so anyway disable the movement this is the important one so why is it working in here with the input and not with the message because the message is going through right so then I starting to unplug and it's like, okay, so with just yes, this note, it works. So one of these notes is the, is the one giving me issues. And the note is this one because I'm setting the camera, right? I think like, um, I don't know how this note works internally, but I think it's just getting refreshed or, or maybe it's that you just need to add the next input, uh, the next note that we're going to talk about, which is this one is set ignore move input, right? So if we hook up this, we're gonna be stopping with the first node I show you and with the second one, it would ignore the move input. So you can see I'm pressing W, I'm moving with all the keys, right? And now if I click next, there you go. My character is perfectly sitting still, not moving one inch, right? And this is what we want, so yeah. Um, Oh, as I said, we're, we were gonna like remove this. Actually, not remove. First on wire. That's a that's another tip I'll give you. First on wire and check. So here we go. Pressing. Yeah, there it is. So yeah, it had nothing to do with the overlapping in itself. Uh, it was just me like grasping a straws there. So there you have it guys, um, if you find this useful let me know and I'll try to make more like short videos like this where I like struggle to find an answer uh, for my projects and I'll put it up for you to, guys to watch. Anyway, see ya.